I have fucking bad skin, so sometimes I use filters and make my skin look better, and they shrink my nose some, like, or I wear wigs that are tight, and they pull my eyebrows, and they make, like, that wig I had on with that bun, yes, it pulled my face because it was a tight wig. And even my stylist, she she was like, yeah, sometimes wigs, they, they pull your face a little bit. It's what happens. Like, I'm 17, about to be 18. I'm not going to look the same as I did when I was fucking 13, 14, 15. It just doesn't work like that. Like, I never got any surgery. I never got my fucking ass and my fucking leg and my fucking toe. Like, nothing about me is fake. Like, y'all are so childish. It's It's, like, annoying. So, anyways... Why do you, why are you being insecure and feel the need to explain? There's a difference between being insecure and people just saying stuff that makes you think like, what the fuck? Like people really believe this shit. And the problem with the internet and the problem with celebrities in the internet is that people think because one person started a rumor that, oh, it's got to be true because we don't really know where to ask her. So yeah, yeah, I guess what they're saying is true. Like it, it's really what happens and I will be damned if I let people just sit up and, and make all these fucking fake rumors about me because then I get... Every rude comment I get on my page is from a rumor, from someone that says something that says something. Like, it's tiring. It's literally tiring. So, like I said, if y'all want to know anything, let me know. I'm here to tell it. I definitely use all this energy to get money too, but eventually I get upset. Yes, it's fucking annoying. Imagine if everybody was talking bad about you and had no reason to. It was just all made of bullshit. And you were losing fans and losing people who, not fans, but... Look, I don't know. I don't even know what to say. Like losing, not, not, not even losing attention. Not, even, not, cause I don't even want to say it like that. Cause it's not losing attention. It's just like losing people who you thought were on your side to fake rumors. Like that's that's not okay. That's really not okay. Like I, I constantly deal with bullshit upon bullshit upon bullshit from shit that happened when I was younger, and it's like, bro, you expect someone to be the same person they were when they were fucking 13 years old. Like, come on, people grow up, people act different. But anyways, like I said, if y'all got questions, y'all wanna know anything, go ahead and let me know, I'm here to tell it. Cause it does, I'm, you, gotta, you gotta remember, I'm young. And when I see a lot of people saying, I, you, I would, before I used to be like, oh, whatever, they just hate him. But when, when you see a lot of people like, really believing shit, it's like, oh, y'all really think that about me? Like, what? And not that I really care about what people think. It's just, like, y'all are that easily influenced by something someone who doesn't even know me says about me. Like, that's weird. Y'all don't see how that's weird? Because y'all know damn well, if half these people see me on the street, it would be, oh, let me get a picture, let me get a picture. Oh, my God, bad baby. It wouldn't be, your your body is fake. Oh, you don't do this. Oh, you think you're this. You think you're that. Like, Bro, what? Come on. Like, I have been so positive lately, and I have been maturing so much. Like I said, I'm getting older. I'm about to have, so I'm about to be 18. I'm about to have so many responsibilities in my hands. Like, I don't have time for all this, but I'll be damned if I'm gonna, like, deal with, st not deal with, I don't know how to say it. I really don't know how to say it. Like, I'm gonna be damned if I'm gonna let shit keep, like, bro, everybody shuts down rumors about themselves. But some of the rumors y'all make about me are just, like, out of this world. Apparently, I fucked every rapper. I've done, I've fucking did all the, like, what? Everybody I've taken a picture with, y'all say I've had sex with them. Everybody. Literally everybody. It could be a fan. Oh, I know she fucked you. Like, what? Just because I'm a girl doesn't mean I'm constantly having sex with people I don't even fucking know. Like, what? I adjust my, for whoever said, adjust your fans, not your haters. I adjust my fans all the time, and I tell them how much I love them, and they always support me. And sometimes I do lives to adjust my fans and talk and, you know, do all that. But sometimes I get frustrated because, like I said, this is the life that I live. And how would you like it if every time you fucking did something good, you were getting bashed for shit you don't even do or shit you didn't even have a part in? Like, imagine if, imagine if somebody wants to work with me, right? This is how I think about it. Imagine somebody wants to work with me and they go on my page and they're like looking through my comments, like seeing how people feel about me. And cause yeah, when, when brands want to work with you, they, they see, Oh, do people like her? Do people not like her? And it's just all, all hate. 
I'm never going to be able to work to a certain extent. You know what I'm saying? Like, people going to be like, oh, yeah, no one likes her. It's just everybody says this about her and she's a horrible person and she's disrespectful. People think I'm disrespectful because if you come for me, I come for you, which is anybody would be like that. It's not just about, oh, I need to talk to every hater. I need to tell every hater about themselves. No, it's that I'm not going to let rumors go around about me that are not true. If you was in high school and you and some little girls was making rumors about you, you would shut them down, right? If, a, if some girls in school made a rumor about you saying, oh, she fucked every guy on the football team, would you let them, would you let them say it? If it was making people look at you weird and, and think bad about you, would you let them say it? Or would you say, that's not true, and here's why that's not true? Oh, okay, that's what I thought. Y'all think I just be boohoo crying because people talk bad about me. When people say, oh, she's ugly, oh, she's, I don't care. But when you try to say, she got her whole body done, she, like, where do you even get that from? Like, who even told y'all this stuff? Or, oh, she's disrespectful, or, oh, she did this, or she's coming at this person, she's problematic. I'm not problematic, and I actually haven't been in any bullshit these past couple months. But if you come for me, I'm going to come for you, depending on who you are. If I know you're just clout chasing, I'm going to let you talk to your blue in the face. But. Yes, and I do plan on being humble and quiet. But I wanted to just come on here and shut down anything anyone had to say about me because sometimes, like I said, it gets back to people who it really matters if it gets back to and that's not okay. I'm, I'm trying to put it in y'all's situation so y'all can understand. Like, I'm trying to think of a, a scenario I could put it for y'all to understand. Oh, okay. I said this before. Imagine you were you 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 and your mom didn't see eye to eye your whole life, right? All that, because that that happens sometimes. You know, you and your parents don't see eye to eye. It's what happens. It's life. Um, you can get into it with anybody. Your mom, your dad, your brother, your sister. It can happen. So, anyways, um, apparently y'all or whatever that had been going on, right? You're you're eighteen, nineteen, about to apply for a job somewhere, and they say. No, you know why? We're not going to hire you because you were disrespectful to your mom. Yeah, we're just, no. Like, what? You're going to take some shit that you don't even know why. Like, y'all don't know the situation between me and my mom. Y'all think because y'all seen 30 minutes of us on a TV show that, oh, we know, we know. No, y'all got to stop judging people off of fucking one show or one series or something. Like, y'all... Even off documentaries, sometimes documentaries still don't tell the whole story. Y'all always take it as explaining myself. Clearing stuff up and explaining myself are two different things. I don't get on here. Y'all don't see me on here crying because people hate me. People gon' hate me. It is what it is. Hating me and making up lies about me that mo if it was just I seen one comment that's like, oh, she got her body done. I wouldn't give a fuck because, OK, you're just hating. But it's like when I see chains of people talking about it and they're like, oh, yeah, she got her nose done. Oh, yeah, I see she got her eyebrows done. Oh, yeah, I see she got her ass done. Oh, yeah, I see she got like you didn't see none of this. And then all these people are talking about it like, oh, yeah, she did. Oh, yeah, she did. Oh, I, I, I can see how that happened. Yeah. All because I took a picture with an angle. Like y'all don't see how that can be aggravating to someone and like I said it's not that I care about what people think it's that y'all give me a bad reputation and I know I'm gonna get told you give yourself a bad reputation no I was a badass little kid when I was young yes but people get older and they change but y'all try to turn all these people who are negative try to turn me into this person I'm not and it's really sad it really is like Okay, anyway, so that's it. Y'all will not see me on this bullshit no more. Y'all got told what y'all needed to be told, and that's it.
So if y'all want to make up y'all lives, go ahead. Like I said, y'all make sure y'all screen, screen recorded this live and got it all down because that's it. This will be the last time I'm talking about this shit. Y'all can go ahead and make up your lives. If y'all want to believe them, go ahead. Y'all are fucking retarded. Y'all are out of y'all fucking minds to believe anything like that. But like I said, bye. See y'all later.